the, did you feel like the Hamzat fight was strange too? Because like here's this guy who has only had a few fights in the UFC. He's got a yeah. lot of hype behind him because he's had like the Mearshart fight was a great result. He looked yeah. fantastic. But then all of a sudden he's fighting you. Yeah. Like it was weird, right? Because we well, two weeks before that, Dana White came out and he's like, oh, nah, I'm never gonna fight Leon or no one in top five. And then <laughs> next week he's like, Leon, you wanna fight him? I was like, You just said oh, you I'm too high ranked for him. But um, Where do you think that came from? I don't know. I don't. Know. I think everyone was turning him down, you know, and uh, um, no one, everyone was turning me down as well. So just like, okay, you want to fight him? I was like, okay. Let, what, what about Kobe? Is that like, Kobe said no? What about Masvidal? Masvidal said no. What about Wonder Boy? Wonder Boy is injured. So I was like, okay, you got the most hype in the division now. Um, that I could like pick it back off to get to a world title shot, right? And this was a kid. Then I like, build him up as this. This kid that can't be beaten is tough, and so I was like, okay, I'll go out there, I'll, I'll, I'll fight him, and when I beat him, I'll fight for the world title, and that that was my plan, right, to use um, this hype they're building around him to get me to a world title shot. I'm always looking towards the title shot, right? So anyway, right, I can get course. there easier. Um, I was going to use Hamzat to to get 